He has used this approach before. The third today. Yes, it's not about you, but it is. Bob Shears, the perfect evaluator. Never a step out of place, anticipates the outcome, even before the answers are given. Unfortunately for Mr. Shear, today will not be what he anticipates. Sir, it's not about me. It's Mama, isn't it? I heard your soft voice, sir. Bob's heart skipped a beat. He turned to face Justin, who was busy munching away at his food from the picnic basket. Why do you lie, sir? He continued. Shush, Justin. Let Mr. Shear continue. Bob Shear is dumbfounded. Soft voice? He hears me. So, the detection is correct. Bob tunes into his focus mental state, which is a defensive discipline to defray queries into the subconscious. In his protective bubble, Bob is able to express his surprise at the raw ability which Justin has in abundance. He can be drained. Sylvia, on the other hand, the momentary lapse of communication from Bob the evaluator was only a millisecond, but internally, within his bubble, time was sufficient for him to arrive at a decision point on how the session should continue. Very good, Justin. You caught me using a ruse. He is anticipating and progressing well. I take it you provided him with ample opportunities to extend himself? His attention was once again focused on Sylvia. Extend? I suppose so. I do apologize for his outburst. He has this tendency to blurt at the most inappropriate time. I have told him about it many times, but as you can see, it isn't easy. He has these peaks which occur sporadically. I am unable to accommodate. Sylvia is disconsolate. There is that sense of defeat from her. Bob Shear has seen this before, but not from someone as young as Justin. Before he could offer his response, It's raining, Mama. Justin was delirious. He had not seen nor felt rain before. Sylvia looks up and her eyes begin to roll up and into her head. And only the whites of her eyes can be seen. Her body loses her thought posture and she immediately crumples on the picnic mat like a lifeless sack, unconscious. Mama! Mama! Vital signs stable. Elevated BP and pupils are dilated. She is in shock. Code blue, get the tray in. Everybody clear. Stop. Everybody stop. Thank you, doctor. We'll take over now. You and your trauma team can leave. Excellent work, I might add. What? She's going into cardiac arrest. We need to... Yes, yes, you do. She is in excellent hands, doctor. Don't worry. The chatter between the well-dressed gentleman and the trauma specialist is replaced with silent awe as another team who are far from medical personnel carrying monitoring equipment and a multitude of scanners begin the job of resuscitating Sylvia. Mr. Pang, Sir, we are ready for hookup. The lab-coated personnel ushers in more team members obviously primed to provide the necessary assistance. Excellent. Please proceed, Doctor. Algorithm startup sequence initiated. Sylvia is online.